All right, YouTube, this is Two Cent back with my Two Cents on Octopath Traveler. And I've seen some folks out there that are pretty confused on how hunts work as far as like the influence is concerned. And so I'm going to show you today just how to go about like looking at that and, you know, creating a team, uh, a team around that to maximize your rewards. So the first thing I, I just suggest is go into your uh, your party setup. You have a bunch of extra teams here that you can use, and that's what part of these are used for. So uh, if you look here, I have uh, up here at the top, I renamed my teams. You can actually press this little button up here uh, and, and enter a new party name. So I have one for fame hunts, for wealth hunts, and for power hunts. And so basically what I did is, I'll get a blank one here for you, is I wish went in and uh, I wanted to choose teams that just had the highest amount of uh, fame. So I went down here to the sorter and just sorted by fame units. And so this is gonna be the top fame and you can kind of see in the top right how much they have. And then I just put the top, you know, eight units I had for that fame uh, into my party and it, you know, gave me uh, enough to get the extra rewards from these, uh, uh, these hunts here. So let me show you when we go into the hunt section now. So I'm going to put it on my fame team, which you can change it over there as well. But let's look at these hunts. So the first thing I did with these hunts is I went through and I cleared all of them with just my main team. I didn't worry about it. I just wanted to have access to being able to do them quickly uh, with, uh, uh, with the auto easy hunt down here at the bottom right. And so look here, uh, I have forming a hunting party. I'm on my fame hunts team. And it says up there at the top, 510 party influence, and that's for the fame here. So if you look at the bottom right, uh, you can see where it takes none to get the first treasure, uh, and then the next two, it's like 300 and then 500. So I've you know maneuvered my team around to be able to get the maximum amount with this, uh, with this team. So if I were to move over, this is my wealth one. So the party influence is zero because I don't have anybody that has fame in there. So uh, that's what you want to do when you're looking at these. The uh, suggested jobs are if you're looking to raise a 3.5 or a 4.5 star up to you know their you know four or three or, or five respectively, then you uh, are going to uh, want to do the one that has the job symbol there because that's the mats that they're going to take to be able to uh, awaken them to that level. So if you look in here, I have my axe user uh, in here that I could get him up. Um, and then there's another sword user. I could do it for that. I don't actually have a lot of uh, 0.5 uh, units, but if I did, I could make use of them in here to uh, to get that. So right now, I'm just farming for the extra equipment and to stock up some of those seals and stuff for when I eventually do pull that. So uh, this is actually the easy hunt that I'm going to do today. So I'm going to go ahead and click that, and we're going to look at uh, what I kind of get for this. And okay, so it's 178,000 experience. So it's not bad experience if you're looking for that in 45,000 uh, uh, of the uh, leaves there. Gets me some levels. And then look here, uh, you get uh, extra sort of uh, things. So I got a seal of enlightenment uh, here times five. Uh, and then you got the tasty nuts to help level up your units there as well. So that's what it's like getting those extra ones. Uh, then you also get uh, the uh, extra seals I got a seal of uh, sacred you know sacred seal of enlightenment as well as two other seals of enlightenment and then all of these uh, ones for uh, guild storms for leveling up your units there so that's what it means by uh, taking the influence into account now let's look at the uh, actual units for how to kind of uh, raise up them I do think that three star units are actually useful uh, at least in the outset for getting your uh, availability to get those higher level ones. So if you see Jose, he's a three star, but he's got a hundred of this, um, you know, influence here. And if we look over at his job board, when you're learning skills, these, you know, this uh, 10 influence here, uh, when he hit 45, uh, that's why I took this guy up past 45 was to get this extra 60. So they have a low amount to start but they have access to this uh, 60 at 45, your uh, higher level units, it takes a while to get to their access to that. It could be like level 65 uh, uh, for, for them. So uh, having that access there allows them to kind of help your team kind of get over those thresholds to be able to do that. So when you eventually unlock for your other units, so let's take a look at um, a high end unit here. Let's go look at Fior. 
So when we learn her skills, she's uh, got another 80 influence that she can unlock here, uh, but it takes level 97. So it's going to be a while before I can get her up that high. Uh, there's another 80 influence here, but she has to be level 92. Uh, there's another 60 here, but she has to be level 84. So obviously your five stars are going to just kill it once they get up there. Uh, and then you'll be able to kind of bring in just kind of whoever you uh, kind of want to need levels on or something like that. But on the outset, you're, uh, you can make use of some of these three stars or other uh, you know units that kind of have a little bit more because their level breakpoints are you know smaller in in uh, in respect to it. So. I hope that kind of helps everybody when you're looking at that. Uh, I do really like think uh, like we're suggesting that you level up your other units just to get this influence anyway, because it does go to your overall influence count as well when you're looking at your path actions and whatnot. Uh, so that does count over for your uh, your influence meters here. So every time you unlock a node, not only does it help you with the hunts, but then it helps increase over here as well. So anyway, that's been my two cents.